In this video, we're gonna go over how to do a barbell B stance hip thrust, okay? So first things first and most important is we make sure that we have both of our pieces of equipment, so our barbell with our weights and as well as our bench, and we want to make sure that our bench is set up to the appropriate height for our body. So for me, I like to grab the aerobic steps because then I can put the amount that I want and the amount that fits my body. But if you are unsure, you have a bench and you're like, do I know if this is gonna work for me? You're gonna go ahead and you're gonna get down to the bench with a nice straight back towards it. And you want the corner of the bench to hit the lower part of your shoulder blades. So that way that when you get into the movement, it's gonna be the appropriate height and you're gonna be able to feel the movement in your glutes. From here, you're going to roll your barbell up your thighs. Make sure that you get nice and center. Let the barbell sit in your hip crease and bend your legs feet shoulder width apart but because we're doing a b stance hip thrust you're actually going to pop your one foot up onto the heel okay so one foot's going to be planted in the ground slightly pointed out toes slightly pointed out and one foot is going to be popped up on the heel with your toes pointed up shoulder blades are driving into the corner of the bench you're going to breathe in engage your core and you're going to drive through your hips and through your glutes all the way up to the top of the movement from here, you're gonna perform a full range hip thrust as you would normally, really making sure you're squeezing those glutes at the top. You're gonna feel it more in the foot that is fully down on the floor than you are in the foot that is placed up. And that's exactly what you want. You might feel it a little bit across both glutes, but you're probably gonna feel it dominant in one side. One thing that's important as well to remember is keep that chin tucked eyes face forward so you're driving through those hips keeping those abs engaged you're going to repeat the desired reps on one side and repeat it on the other then you've done your b stance hip thrust